The state's amended budget into law this afternoon. Lots of changes and some extra cash. Employees who have struggled in the pandemic are going to get that. Haley Mason live at the Capitol to explain. Haley. Rick, while the total of this amended budget this year rings in at well over $26.5 billion, and a lot of those coins are going towards a focus on education and rebuilding from the pandemic. Governor Brian Kemp putting ink to paper this afternoon, signing the state's amended 2021 budget into law. An accomplishment he touts is that it comes without additional strain to the current pandemic struggles. No new cuts to state agencies, no furloughs, no layoffs and no new taxes to pay for it all. And in the budget, Kemp reemphasizes his focus on education. This budget provides more than $610 million in amended FY 2021 funding for K through 12 education, fully funding enrollment growth and holding individual schools harmless in the current fiscal year for any reductions in enrollment they had due to COVID-19. Beyond the classroom, this chart shows other highlights, including a one-time $1,000 bonus for state employees, $20 million to expand rural broadband, $1 million for tourism marketing, and nearly $300,000 for hospitals and health care workers. This balanced budget funds our priorities and sets our state on a clear path to a strong recovery in the coming months. Now, this budget also includes money for transportation, public safety and natural resources. It has drawn criticism, though, for not adding more funding to the struggling uh, Department of Labor that has struggled since the pandemic, given rising jobless numbers. Reporting live inside the state capitol, Haley Mason, CBS 46 News.